Hello Year 9, this is your third music lesson on music theory and your research projects. Before we get started, as usual, any videos you're looking for, any previous lessons can be found on the school YouTube channel. When it comes to uploading your work to class charts, again, Word document, PowerPoint, you can screenshot your work or take a photo of any written work, make sure that it's clear and then you can upload it that way. Along with that, your research project, the research project that you should be working on over the past few weeks is due on the 12th of February. So that means you have about three weeks to complete the work and submit it. So please do not get it all done in the last second. Keep working on it week by week as I keep asking you to do a slide or two every week. And if you haven't completed any previous lessons, you should go back and make sure that they are completed as it will help you as we go along. For today's lesson, is to research so the lesson objective is to research about various musical terminology and to use these terms when describing music so at the very least today i'm expecting you to be able to list different musical terms once you're able to do that you should be able to understand and describe the meaning of these various musical terms and then the green box on the right once you've done the two boxes before you should be able to analyze a piece of music in depth using the musical terminology that we've been looking over which will create a clear argument for what you're trying to say about a song so very least they should be able to list and tell me a number of different musical terms then you should be able to work out and be able to describe them and then you should be able to use them in describing a piece of music clearly so for task number one I would like you to research and write down the definition of each of these terms. So I've already given you term one it is a rhythm a pattern of long and short notes played over a pulse. So I've given you one. You've still got six more to do. So that's melody, dynamics, texture, instrumentation and pitch. Please make sure that you understand what you're writing for each of these terms. So don't just like copy and paste it off Wikipedia, make sure you understand what you're writing before you put it down, because you need to understand the term, not just have an answer for it. And once you've done that, please make sure that you've written it down and that you take a photo of it so you can upload it so I can see how well you understand. Once you've done task one, task two, I'd like you to go and listen to a song called Never Ending City by Bill Lawrence. It can be found on YouTube, but I've also put the link to it in the notes section below of this PowerPoint. Once you listen to it, or while listening to it, or once, once you've done a few listens to it, I'd like you to write at least six lines describing your interpretation of the song's emotions. Okay, so I'd like you to listen to the song, listen to what emotions you think the song is trying to get across. This does not mean that you describe how you feel about the song. Okay, a little disclaimer. Not how you feel about the song. So you can't say, I think the song's boring. It's not about how you feel about the song. You should be referring to what you think the artist is trying to say emotionally. What emotions is, is the artist, is Bill Lawrence trying to get across? There might even be m multiple emotions. All right. You should try and explicitly use all the terms from the previous slide that we just did so that's why you've been researching them and you should be using these terms in describing them so when it comes to multiple emotions as I said this is where it sort of comes from you might say something the rhythm suggests that the song is happy but the melody may suggest that it's sad so there's multiple emotions that come along as long as you back up why you think that is uh, and then you should use these terms correctly in describing the song so make sure that you're not just saying that uh, it has fast dynamics or something like that and you're just making it up because fast obviously dynamics is to do with volume so you only have loud or quiet you can't have fast take the time with that one i want at least six lines you could do a whole page if you so wish i'm very happy for you to do that but at least six lines of really good writing describing the song using the terms that we just looked at Once you've done that, can you continue your research project? I've given you a bit to do today, so uh, I'm only expecting you to do slide five for this one. Uh, as said before, you do not need to upload it yet. You still have three weeks to get it completed. Please keep adding to your research project. Thank you very much, Year 9. Hope you're all well.